Hey, it's Lawrence here from highintensitybusiness.com. Hope you're doing well. Do you find that you're always working in your business so you never find time to actually work on and grow your strength training studio? This is a very common problem in the strength training industry among both startups and mature strength training businesses where we get so focused on working in the business and taking on all the roles that we actually can't step back and make the time to figure out how to grow our business and actually reduce some of our workload so we can focus on our unique ability. I've got a great tip for you to help you actually foster this and start to make progress on actually stepping back and growing your business. It's a really simple tip and it's called time blocking. Time blocking is where you block out two to three hours in your diary once or twice a week, and you actually make a real effort to protect that time. So you don't train clients in that time, you don't take calls, you use that time to actually work on your business. So that could be focusing on a constraint in your business, and if you think about it for a few seconds, you probably know the big barrier that you need to focus on in your business to take it to the next level, and so it could be that you spend that time working on that and finding a solution. Or it could be, for example, creating SOPs or checklists. And these are just simple systems or processes where you identify what are the bullets, what are the, what are the items that we need to achieve or the tasks that need to be achieved in order to um, successfully complete tasks in the business. So that could be sales process for your free introductory workouts. It could be how you run your normal workout session. And obviously once you have these defined, you can actually hire individuals to fulfill those roles. So these are the types of activities that you wanna be dedicating these time blocks for. So it's a super simple tip, but most most of us neglect actually time blocking every week to focus on work to move the business forward and work on the business. Another quick tip on this is you need to identify the type of work you'll be doing in that time block the week or day before the day that has the time block. Because what you'll find is if you don't identify the actual work you'll be doing, when you come to arrive at doing that time block, you just probably won't have the mental willpower to actually identify the highest priority thing you could be doing. And so what often happens is we default to checking email or doing some other busy work that is not going to move the business forward. So hopefully you found that helpful. Time block in a recurring two to three hour chunk in your diary every single week and make that time to actually focus on moving your business forward, building out checklists, focusing on the constraint, the thing that you keep putting off, and I guarantee you, you will grow your business much faster. My name is Lawrence, and this is highintensitybusiness.com.